Hello all, a very warm welcome to this new YouTube channel, Alpha PF Tips. This is the very first video of this channel with the hope to share core knowledge of various topics that would be covered in this and in future videos. So here we are presenting you with PISA 2021, that is 2021. PISA is an exam which is going to be held in 2021. In this video, we will discuss about Integrated Design of PISA 2021 released by OECD. So let's start with what is PISA and why PISA. PISA is a program for international student assessment. It is a three-tier international survey that evaluates skills and knowledge of 15-year-old students, school-going children, by testing their mathematics, science and reading literacy by pass of every three years. It is coordinated by Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development that is OECD. The link is given below. Now why PISA? PISA only measure 15 years old skills because till this age a student completes his basic education. This exam PISA will be conducted in two modes, main survey and field trial. Both the modes have same designing but the sample collection is different. Sample means the type of students or the number of students. PISA is basically based on cognitive assessment. Cognitive means that how much knowledge we have, how we put our, our knowledge in our daily routine and how fast we learn. This assessment has total five domains, reading literacy, mathematics literacy, scientific literacy, creative thinking, and financial literacy. Out of these five domains, the mathematics literacy is a major domain and the other are minors. Reading, mathematics, and science. These three are the main core domains. Whereas creative thinking is an innovative domain and financial literacy is an additional one which will be discussed in upcoming video. Now we have two major components of PISA 2021 that is student components and non-student components which are further subdivided into different type of questionnaires. Now green components are of students and the blues are of non-students. Student components comprises of cognitive assessment, student questionnaire and optional questionnaire. Whereas non-student components comprises of school questionnaire, teacher questionnaire and parent questionnaire. Both the components whether student or non-student will be conducted in two methods computer based or paper based. Let us first discuss about the designing of student components. Computer based. This will be divided into three sections. The very first is cognitive assessment and it will last up to 120 minutes that is 2 hours. In this section the student will be assessed upon their reading, mathematics, science and creative thinking. And the financial is an additional sample which will not be included as such in the main survey but its sample will be collected for further usage. The second section is student questionnaire and it will be lasted for 35 minutes. This, this section will be detailed, will be discussed in detail in our upcoming video of PISA. And the third section is an optional one which totally depends upon student to whether attend or to pass means not to attend. It comprises of global competence which will judge the knowledge, attitude and skills of a student that how they act on issues of global significance, well-being, their comfort level, psychological, sociological and physiological traits, ICT familiarity that how much a student is familiar about the electronic gadgets and their functions. And the last one is financial literacy. That is how a student handles the money, money matters, 
whether they know about the various types of accounts in the bank, how to save money, how to use it, etc. etc. Paper based. This is divided into two sections cognitive assessment and student questionnaire. There is no optional questionnaire in this one. The cognitive assessment will last up to 120 minutes, that is 2 hours, and the students will be assessed upon their reading literacy, mathematics literacy, and scientific literacy. The second section student questionnaire will last up to 35 minutes. Let us now move to the non-student components design. This design has principals, teachers, and parents. As these three are directly involved in building up the student's behavior. It could be computer based or paper based. The first is computer based. It is divided into three sections, school, teacher and parent. The very first section is school questionnaire and it will be lasting up to 60 minutes. In this questionnaire, the school background, its management, its teaching staff, the policy for assessment and evaluation by laws, school climate, that why the school is crowded, its surroundings, its locality, all will be asked. One additional form for the principals are included, which will be of 45 minutes. The second sectional is completely optional one. It is for teachers. This category or this section is further split into three modules, teacher questionnaire, core teacher and well-being module. The teacher questionnaire will be of 60 minutes and here the teachers will be assessed by their basic general knowledge. The second is core teacher in which subject expertise will be checked. The next is well-being module where the teachers overall behavior so sociological, psychological, physiological traits will be checked and it will last up to 20 minutes. This whole section is of about uh, 125 minutes. The third section is of parent questionnaire and it's a totally optional questionnaire. Here the parents will fill their general information like their name, their address, income, etc, etc and will be asked about the student's behavior at home or the daily routine what the student does after going home and it will be of 35 minutes. The next is computer based Inhari integrated design. Inhari is an option for special needs students. This is a computer based test till now but could be extended to the paper based also. It is divided into two sections in her test session and in her student questionnaire. The first in her test session will last for 60 minutes. It is a cognitive assessment based on reading, mathematics and scientific literacy, which are the three core domains of our designing. The next section in her student questionnaire will last up to 20 minutes. So in this video, we have covered the overall integrated designing of PISA to be held in 2021. The major components, computer based, paper based, the sections, the modules, the domains, financial literacy, additional samples, field trip, main survey, many more. The all things will be discussed in detailing in our upcoming videos. A big, big, big thanks to all the viewers of this video and please, please, please like, share, comment and subscribe our channel Alpha PS Tips so that you could be notified about our next video. Bye.